وكذلك أوحينا إليك روحا من أمرنا ما كنت تدري ما الكتاب ولا الإيمان ولكن جعلناه نورا ولكن جعلناه نورا نهدي به من نشاء من عبادنا وإنك لتهدي إلى صراط مستقيم صراط الله الذي له ما في السماوات وما في الأرض ألا إلى الله تصير الأمور بسم الله you're watching the mailbox we have a website called islammailbox.com I'm Yusuf Estes and we take the emails as they come in and some of the former ones that we have in front of me and what we're looking for is good answers to good questions. The first one I get says, what's bad breath in Islam? What is that all about? Bad breath. <laughs> okay. First time I got this question. Bad breath. All right. Uh, Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, taught us that when we have eaten onions or garlic or anything like that, and we have this on our breath, not to go to the masjid or the mosque because what offends the children of Adam offends the angels of mercy. I think that's more or less the translation of it. Allah knows best. What we do know from this that it is makhru, highly hated, very much uh, close to haram for anybody to go into the masjid with their breath having this on it. Now, Another thing about bad breath, though, is that when it's as a result of fasting, because you didn't eat or drink, such as in Ramadan or uh, Nafla fasting, in this case, it's actually something that's very beautiful to Allah and smells as musk to Allah. This is from the, one of the hadiths of Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. So bad breath can be bad, or it actually can be good bad breath. <laughs> yeah, we, got another, we got another one coming in here. Okay, it says, what is the Kaaba? What does it represent? Some people said it's a black box in the desert and Muslims are worshiping it. No, that's not true. We don't worship it. We don't worship anything in it. What we worship is the God of the universe who's ordered us to face that direction when we worship so that all of us are in congruity as the jama, Arabic word for being in, a, in Congress, facing the same way at the same time. And because it's a focal point, that means as it goes out to like circles. The circle around it gets bigger and bigger and bigger as you get out of town until you got people that are on opposite ends of the earth all still facing that same direction toward the Kaaba. There's a lot about that on our website, as is a lot of the other things that we talk about in our program. So visit our website. It's called IslamMailbox.com. And we're going to be waiting for your emails to come to us, and we'll read them right here on the mailbox. Till next time, peace. Assalamu alaikum.